Today, we're a data-driven society, data-driven companies, uh, data drives all of our lives. And, and being able to understand that data and you know, find kind of gems of insight in that data, and even more, being able to communicate effectively with data is more important today than it's ever been. Having tools that help people do that, that's, I think, one of the big challenges that we face right now. Sandance is a data visualization system that lets people explore data, find insights in that data, and communicate those insights with others. There's a great data set that looks at demographic information in the United States. It looks at the uh, levels of education and income in all the counties. Typically, you'd think that the greater the education you have in a county, uh, the more income there would be in the family. And that's often true, that's the overall trend. But I found this kind of weird outlier, and the, the, the highest education, at least according to uh, the percentage of the people that had a bachelor's degree or more, actually had a very low income level. I looked at where it was, and it was Stanford, California. And it kind of made sense that they were working on their higher degrees and not getting paid much. But then I looked at other outliers that were just like that. It turns out that every single one of these places that had high education levels but low income, every one of them was a college town. 20 of them, all these points, they're all out there. And I, I thought that was really interesting. I never would have looked at before, but when I saw the pattern in the data, I found that. A lot of the people that look at data visualization systems tend to be data analysts, but I think there's a much wider audience out there. I think that people that are, are fans of kind of understanding patterns in society and looking at uh, economic trends or political trends or, or anything really. I think there's a very wide audience that can take these applications if they're made easy enough and compelling enough.